Good morning guys and welcome back to the coffee channel. So great to see all your smiling faces. I you think I can't see it. Let's get to it. So I am back with yet another coffee review video. Yes, this bag is empty because it's in here. Today, this is a coffee I've never heard of before. A uh, viewer of the channel sent this to me. This is from this is from Tori Labity. It's called Pilot Coffee Roasters, and I believe they're out of Toronto. We're gonna have a little more on them in a second. However, this is the Monument brand from Pilot. It says it has the notes of molasses, chocolate, and a full-bodied flavor. I can tell you, um, this is empty. This is, oh, I got a little bit left in it. I've already been drinking it. But I will tell you, and I'm gonna tell you again, but I will tell you, this is the only coffee that I have had that suggested there was chocolate and I could actually smell it. I kid you not. All the other coffees that I've had that said there was, that there was caramel or a hint of chocolate, I never could smell it. I can taste and smell it in here and it actually tastes pretty good but I gotta grind some more up we're gonna have a taste grinder I can definitely smell the chocolate and the caramel it's not as strong as some of the coffees that I've been drinking although it is considered a dark roast the beans are a light brown in color I'll show you that you can see the difference here these are the pilot beans a little lighter roast still considered a dark roast but not as dark as some of the colonial coffee that I've been drinking uh, this is the silver brand from colonial coffee so you can really see the difference between the two still a great taste but because uh, a lot of the coffee that I've been drinking, the beans are actually black. That is the dark roast. But uh, this one here is kind of a light brown, but it's got a good flavor to it. So right out of the grinder pod. All right, folks, you all know how this goes. First, we're going to try it black. Then we're going to try it with milk. And while we're waiting, we're going to check out Pilot Roasters. All right. First of all, you can go to PilotRoasters.com and check them out for yourself. First place I went was the About Us page. So I want to see what the company's actually like. Now I'm going to read you their mission statement and this says a lot about the company itself. Uh, I'm a firm believer in, in the, the farmers picking the coffee need to benefit. And all too often they don't. So this is Pilot Coffee Roasters mission statement. We want to roast great coffee and work with great people to do it. But it is more important than just great coffee. Every bag of Pilot Coffee Roasters beans represents a global community of dedicated professionals, specialized skill, and a lot of hard work. What drives us is our passion. What guides us is our commitment to quality, innovation, and exceptional service. This is under the direct trade quote. The perfect roast is only possible if it begins with, if it begins with the perfect bean. And that is 100% correct. 
It says here, we track down and source exceptional coffee by working closely with our trusted partners on the ground and traveling to the coffee's origin. The truth is, we would be nowhere without the skilled effort of the farmers and the workers producing high quality coffees to share through the roastery. So they have a high respect for the actual farmer growing the coffee. Therefore, I have a high respect for them. All too often in this business, the farmer, the farmer growing the coffee doesn't benefit. They get very little money for what they're growing. This is billions and billions of dollars in coffee sold around the world. I mean, I, I, I'm sure I'm way low on that. However, they're not being compensated properly. So, Pilot Coffee Roasters out of Toronto, Ontario. Thank you for thinking of the farmer. Okay. Definitely got that chocolate smell. Definitely have that. I don't know if you can tell from past videos, however, it's not as dark in the glass. This is going to be hot, but let's give it a shot. That's not bad. I can taste the chocolate and the caramel. Like I said, I've already been drinking this for the past few days. It, does, it is good coffee. It's a great morning coffee. I also had it in the evening, and I thought maybe yeah, it might keep me up at night, but didn't do that at all. Let's put some milk in it. This one here, I could definitely drink black. Let's see how this goes. Black is better. Never thought I would say that, but black is better. Before we go, we're going to get into a couple of facts about Pilot Coffee Roasters. Like I said, Pilot Coffee Roasters is located in Toronto, Ontario. Uh, they obviously import their coffee beans and they roast them on site. This year, 2019, they are celebrating 10 years in business. Congratulations, Pilot Coffee, if you're watching. Okay, they offer barista training. They offer merchandise as well. And they are, and right now I'm in their category called single origin coffee. Uh, we've talked about that before as to what single origin is. Uh, that's when they, it comes from one specific farm. So I'm looking up the different coffees here. I have the Monument, Monument brand. And I'm not seeing it here. The average price of this 12 ounce bag of coffee is anywhere from 19 to 20 dollars. It's a little on the high side, but uh, it is it is really good coffee. Pilot, you got some pretty good coffee here. Your ethics, I really like your ethics as well. Um, I have talked a lot before on the coffee bar regarding the farmers not getting the respect and the, the finances they deserve. Ethics like this helps the farmer grow in the coffee that you and I enjoy every day. So remember, like I always say, the best way to drink coffee is the way you like to drink it. That's all I got for today's video. I'll see you all in the next one. Later. Well, folks, thanks for joining me today. I do appreciate it very much. Before we go, I wanted to let you know that I did start a video production company called To Crease Media. I will create a 30 to 60 second video to tell your company's story. How's that for a shameless plug?